Well, Gene and I are complete opposites. Complete opposites. So where he is very calm, methodical, I, on the other hand, fly off the handle, get really upset, I get emotional, I, I want it done now. I think we end up soothing each other even though we're complete opposites because he has to soothe me to bring me down like calm down that will it's going to work out we're going to get it we're going to get to the to what we need so you know he's dealing with that and I can go in and say you know you're awfully quiet what's wrong tell me what's wrong let's talk about it communication like I say and uh, you know always there always you know willing to talk to one another about things and not just you know throw up your hands and walk away type thing what attracted to me, to him to me, was obviously things I'd never want to change. Now, his manana approach to life, <laughs> yes, I'd love for that to go away, but that's Gene, that's Gene. Mm -hmm. I've learned to deal with that, but I've also learned to be a lot more forceful and say, no, it's not going to take six months to get the kitchen done. It will take six weeks, and that's what the approach will be. Our marriage is still still with passion, and you know, not boring at all. You know, we we still enjoy each other's company. Life is too grim if you don't have a sense of humor, and if you don't have somebody that makes you laugh, can find the funny part of life. I'm not saying it makes fun of things. I'm saying actually can find humor when it can be pretty bleak out there, and this man can do that. <laughs> so I try. I think the best thing for a marriage is making sure that you think of every day as an anniversary day. And that you kiss and you hug and you tell each other you love each other. All the time. All the time. <laughs>